The Sao languages are a branch of Sino-Tibetan languages spoken in eastern India, parts of Bangladesh, and Burma. Alternative names Ethnologue calls the group Jingfo Konyak Bodo, while Scott Delancey 2015, refers to it as Bodo Konyak Jingpa, BKJ. Classification within Sino-Tibetan Scott Delancey 2015, considers the Sao languages, which he refers to as Bodo Konyak Jingpa, BKJ, to be part of a wider Central Tibeto-Burman group. Internal classification Benedict 1972 7, noted that the Bodo Garo, Konyak, and Jingfo Kachin, languages, as well as the extinct Cheryl language, shared distinctive roots for sun and fire. Berling 1983, proposed a grouping of the Bodo Garo, Konyak, Northern Naga, and Jingfo languages, characterized by several shared lexical innovations, including asterisk sal. Sun. STEDT number 2753 Asterisk War Fire STEDT number 2152 Asterisk S Ra Sky STEDT number 3571 Asterisk Wa Father STEDT number 5484 Asterisk new mother STEDT hash sixteen twenty one Berling nineteen eighty three called the proposed group Sal after the words Sal San and Jan for son in various of these languages. Coop two thousand twelve to two hundred one minus two hundred four argues that some of Berling. S proposed innovations are either not attested across the Sal languages or have cognates in other Sino Tibetan languages. Nevertheless, Matasoff 2013 accepts Berling's Sal group and considers asterisk s ra sky ra and an asterisk new mother to be the most convincing Sal innovations. The family is generally presented with three branches: Berling 2003 to 175, Thurgood 2003 to 11. The Bodo Garo languages, including the Bodo and Koch languages, are spoken in the northeast Indian states of Meghalaya and Tripura. The Konyak languages are spoken by the Naga people in southeastern Arunachal Pradesh and northeastern Nagaland, both in northeastern India. This group is called Eastern Naga by Berling and Northern Naga by other authors. The remaining languages of Nagaland belong to the separate Kuki Chin Naga group. The Kachinic or Jingfo Luish languages include Jingfo, Jingpa, Singpo or Kachin, spoken in northern Burma and adjacent regions, and the Luish or Sak languages spoken in western Burma. Schaefer had grouped the first two as his Barak division, and Bradley 1997 also combines them as a subbranch. Bradley 1997, tentatively considers Pyu and Kuki Chin Naga to be possibly related to Sal, but is uncertain about this. Peterson 2009, considers Mru Kongso to be a separate Tibeto-Burman branch, but notes that Mru Kongso shares similarities with Bodo Garo that could be due to the early split of Muic from a Tibeto-Burman branch that included Bodo Garo. Van Driem 2011 The Brahmaputran branch of Van Driem 2011 has three variants Bodo Garo and Konyak Bodo Garo, Konyak, and Demolish. Bodo Garo, Konyak, Demolish, and Kachin Luik. The smallest is his most recent, and the one Van Driem considers a well-established low-level group of Sino-Tibetan. However, Demolish is not accepted as a Sal language by Glottolog. Sotrug 2015, and Gerber, et al., 2016, consider Demolish to be particularly closely related to the Kuranti languages rather than to the Sal languages. Matasov, 2012-2013 
James Modisoff, 2012, makes the following observations about the Sao grouping. Although Bodo Garo and Northeastern Naga Konyak are indeed closely related, Jingfo and Northeastern Naga Konyak seem to be even more closely related to each other than Jingfo and Bodo Garo or to each other. Luish is the Tibeto-Burman branch most closely related to Jingfo, for which further evidence is provided in Matasov 2013. Similarities between Jingfo and Nungish are due to contact. Thus, Nungish is not particularly closely related to Jingfo, and is not a Sao language. On the other hand, Lolo Burmese appears to be more closely related to Nungish than to Jingfo. Matasov 2012 notes that these Tibeto Burman branches did not split off neatly in a tree like fashion, but rather form a linkage. Nevertheless, Matasov 2013 30 still provides the following stambaum for the Sal branch. Salvodo Garo Jingfo Konyak Konyakian, Northern Naga Jingfo Asakian Jingfoic Asakianth and classified extinct Taman language of northern Myanmar display some similarities with Luish languages, Jingfo, and Bodo Garo, but it is undetermined whether Taman is a Sao language or not. References Bibliography Benedict, Paul K. 1972, Sino-Tibetan, A Conspectus, PDF, Cambridge, Cambridge University Press, ISBN 978-0-521-08175-7. Bradley, David. 1997. Tibeto-Burman Languages and Classification. PDF, in Bradley, David, Tibeto-Burman Languages of the Himalayas, Papers in Southeast Asian Linguistics, 14, Canberra, Pacific Linguistics, pp. 1-71, ISBN 978-0-85883-456-9. Burling, Robbins, 1983. The Sao Languages. PDF, Linguistics of the Tibeto-Burman Area, 7, 2, 1-32, 2003. The Tibeto-Burman Languages of Northeast India. In Thurgood, Graham, Lapola, Randy J., Sino-Tibetan Languages, London, Routledge, pp. 169-191, ISBN 978-0-7007-1129-1. Koop, Alexander R. 2012. Overcounting numeral systems and their relevance to subgrouping in the Tibeto-Burman languages of Nagaland. PDF, Languages and Linguistics, 13, 1, 193 to 220. Van Driem, George, 2001, Languages of the Himalayas, an Ethnolinguistic Handbook of the Greater Himalayan Region, Brill, ISBN 978-90-04-12062-4. Twenty fourteen. Trans Himalayan. PDF, in Owen Smith, Thomas, Hill, Nathan W., Trans Himalayan Linguistics, Historical and Descriptive Linguistics of the Himalayan Area, Berlin, Mouton de Gruyter, pp. 11 40, ISBN 978 3 11 031083 2. Thurgood, Graham. 2003. A Subgrouping of the Sino Tibetan Languages. In Thurgood, Graham, Lapola, Randy J., Sino-Tibetan Languages, London, Routledge, pp. 3-21, ISBN 978-0-7007-1129-1.